Hello everyone, in this video I am going to show you that how you can add accordion in your FAQs page. So currently on my screen you can see that I have already implemented this uh, for my Shopify store. So if you are interested to use this then you have no need to install any app into your store. You only need to copy and paste the code and then you are done. I have already added the link below in the description. So you just download the code and just uh, paste it and then you are done. So here you can see that we have questions, then we have answers, we have plus and minus symbol. So if you want you can change the color, uh, background color of this uh, text or maybe this heading. So let me show you how I implement it step by step. So uh, here you can see that I have some code which I have already added. So you need to go to the Shopify dashboard and I have installed debut theme for this. So if you have installed any other theme, then you can watch my specific video for that theme or maybe you can also try this. If you still face any issue, you can connect me. I have added the contact details below in the description. All right. So for this, we are interested to uh, try for debut theme. So first of all, you need to click on actions. Then you need to click on edit code and uh, you have to go to the folders and files of your backend. So here you will get the list of all the files and folders. Uh, for example, here we have layout, template, section. So you need to click on layout. Then we have to click on theme.liquid. And here you need to find out uh, the, the closing head tag. So here you can see that we have close head tag. All right. So I have already added the code. Let me remove this code. So I have this code up to here. So I'm going to delete this code and then let me save these changes. All right. So once you saved these changes, let me refresh this page again. So here you will see that we have no more that accordion design which was before. So here we have only questions and then we have the answers. So that means we need to add some code which is actually solving this problem. So one more thing is uh, for example, you are going to pages and here you will get that specific FAQ page and uh, there you have to follow one thing which is for example, I am clicking on FAQ accordion then you need to click on actually show F HTML. So this is actually the HTML. So you always have to follow a structure which I will be mentioning here. So for example, I am removing this code from here. Let me save these changes. And if I'm refreshing this page again, then you will know more able to see those uh, text. So let me show you how you will be adding. So I have already added the code. Step one is you need to paste this code. This is the whole bunch of code, which is from here to step uh, just above the step two. All right. So you need to copy this and you need to paste it inside of this. But make sure that you should uh, have selected this show HTML. All right. Then after, let me uh, show you one more thing. For example, you are interested to uh, update the text. For example, I have written by product and you want something else. For example, you want question uh, first. All right. So in the same way, if you want, you can actually uh, change the text of the description. So in the same way, you should go here. And for example, here I have already the same thing which is by product so i am interested to write here question one maybe and let me save these changes and if, then you need to click on view page so this will be actually giving you the preview for example i have clicked that and now you can see that we have question one that is like the text which we have updated just now now we are interested to uh, modify it's the coding part so again you need to go to the file which you will have downloaded and here i have this coding part which is second step so i need to copy this whole bunch of code from here but make sure the uh, read the disk uh, read the instructions step two is paste below code in theme.liquid file just above head tag so i'm going to copy this whole bunch of code from here to here and then let me go to theme.liquid and here i have already uh, observed that forward slash head tag this is close tag and just above i am going to paste it so i have pasted that code let me save these changes then the third step is third step is paste below code in theme.liquid file just above head tag so again i need to add this library all right but uh, before adding this let me follow the fourth step first so for example i am going to again 
पेस्ट बिलो कोड इन थीम डॉट लिक्विड फाइल जस्ट अबाउ हेड टैग सो आई एम गोइंग टू कॉपी दिस होल बंच ऑफ कोड ऑफ जावा स्क्रिप्ट एंड पेस्ट इट जस्ट अबाउ हेड टैग ऑल राइट आई हैव सेव दिस चेंजेस सो फर्स्ट एग्जाम्पल आई एम इंटरेस्टेड टू सी द प्रीव्यू नाउ सो हेर यू कैन सी दैट the same thing is applied that means design is implemented now we have no need to worry about anything but we have not followed the third step why because sometime we already have added jquery library so if you have already added i mean sometimes in some uh, themes that is already available so if that is not available for example this accordion is not working at all for you so you need to actually copy this line and uh paste it just above this script which we have just now added so let me show you here is the script and i am going to paste it just above it and then save the changes and then you are good to go click on view page and then you can see that the changes are already there so this is one of the best way to implement accordion which is question answer and here you can see that we have a uh, different uh, style we have different colors we have font size if you are thinking this is not good for you you want it to improve you can hire me actually so i am available for you i have already added the contact details below in the description so there are multiple things inside of it if you want to make it more eye catchy more professional more better then we can actually improve according to your requirement but this is one of the best and professional uh, faq page uh, which you can use for your customers so this is really helpful for your store so if you want you can actually implement it into your shopify store so thank you so much for watching this video if you are thinking this was useful then please like this video also subscribe this channel and make sure if you have any suggestion for any specific video so add a comment in the comment section so that i could upload in future thank you once again see you in the next video